Hey, what's up guys? Cam and Cave Gaming here, bringing you a brand new video of Black Desert Mobile. Guys, this week we did not have a update, so there's not many things that's been added in the game, but keep in mind guys, we do still have um, some events that are really valuable to do, and that's going on right now, such as the DICE event. It'll probably, it's going to end in four days, so make sure you guys are doing it. But um, yeah, anyway, so guys, today in this video, we are going to jump into a few ranked arena match and you can see right now my arena rank is at 4400 and currently around number 120 in the world i believe if I, let me check the rank my rank right here yeah i'm currently 124 in the world and 33 in my server and yeah guys so after the last few videos i posted about reaper pvp you guys have given me a lot of good advice on how to use her skills especially the teleport skill nightmare and how to as well as how to use her combos so guys um today we are going to jump into some high level ranked arena i'm at currently at 4400 and to see i'm gonna show you guys how what i've learned so far with reaper and how to better analyzing her skills all right guys let's jump into today's video All right, guys, right now we are going to jump into our first match and just got to make sure I have my um, my skill set right. And yep, I have my PvP stone on and start match over here. All right, looks like we'll be facing a level 72 and it will be a Huntress. Okay. Guys, Huntress are still so good in PvP, even though um, there's so many new Awakening classes out. She's still one of the top class to play in PvP. And yep, guys, but with the, all the damage, that crazy amount of damage that we do, that wasn't too hard for us. And we'll get a total of 33, uh, 33 points for Arena. And guys, before I jump into the next match, let me show you guys my new branch build. So... As you know that Reaper, his mo his most significant skill, which is this the spinning one, it only uh, requires a heap and serret, but serret is pretty much useless. So there's pretty much only one choice for you, a heap. But most of Reaper's skills also has all damage at the brief. And guys, I've said in my previous video, all da all damage branch does the most damage out of all, and the uh, follow up is the brief with max critical hit damage and then a heap. So guys take a look over here i've somehow maxed out all my branch damage besides serret so that way i will do maximum damage as a raper and so basically what i did is changing all my crystals to those three branch damage and the rest i just level my orange accessory uh, orange accessories up to plus four so i had that plus two branch damage on all uh branch damage boost all right guys, and now we are going to jump into the match number two. And it looks like we'll be facing the same person, which is that Huntress. And let's see what we can do. Okay, so you guys been telling me how to use this teleport skill. Okay. Yeah, Huntress, she is strong mostly because she has so many dodges and is, hot, is hard to... Uh, it's hard to dodge around her move, but guys, did you see that? With Max, a heap, all in the brief, I pretty much took down half of her health with only half a combo. So, yeah, guys, make sure if you're beating a uh, Reaper, you can either go for a heap of the brief if you cannot max out three of your branch, but if you can, make sure you do all damage, the brief, and a heap. Those three branch damage is gonna bring you, give you a lot of damage dealing when it comes to PvP. All right, guys, round number three, um, it will be the same Huntress. And guys, I think this video today is just going to be Reaper versus Huntress. And I mean, Huntress are pretty strong. So this will be a good chance for me to show you guys why is Reaper such a good class right now? Because I can defeat Huntress easily. OK, I did not use my nightmare skill well right there. Might be a little cocky right now. I need to calm down and focus on the game. Okay, she is almost done over here. 
just one more hit she will be over and guys she's not doing much damage to me either okay let me heal myself back up guys we are actually kind of close right now so i need to be careful with what i do well guys never be too cocky okay never be too cocky while you're playing uh ranked arena is not good for you but we do have a lucky number right now four 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 all right guys we are going to face a number 72 and it's still going to be another huntress and let's see how we can do okay She has a higher DP than the last one because we're doing less damage compared to the last one. I think she's higher CP than me as well. Okay, haven't had a good chance to jump in yet. Ugh, I made so many mistakes in that one. Yeah, my dash is out. This is not looking good. And plus, ugh. This is so ugly. All right, guys. Let's forget about that. And we are going to jump into the next match. All right, guys. Brand new match, level 71. And we are going to face a striker. Guys, striker actually recently has been pretty strong. What am I doing? All right, guys, that was a really easy round somehow. But yeah, actually, I've, lately I've been having some hard time fighting strikers and they are actually pretty good from what I've seen so far. And okay, it looks like it will be a Berserker, guys. Let me show you this. Berserker, they are actually really strong in uh, 1v1 PvP. And once they uh, transfer into that shadow form, guys, they do a lot of damage and it's actually quite hard to fight against him this one has high DP as well I'm barely doing damage to him oh no and guys he's not even in that shadow form right now so you can just tell he's way higher CP than me we are looking even right now but it's not good for us because whenever he transfers into that shadow form he's gonna heal a lot of his HP back up yet yeah, like that Okay, guys, we are not looking good. He's doing a lot of damage to us, and we are barely doing any damage to him. All right. Ah. Oh. That was really close, guys. All right, guys, so the last few rounds has been, hasn't gone really well for us, and let's see how we can do this time. It will be that striker again, and this shouldn't be too hard from our previous experience fighting him. Okay, let's see. All right. Guys, that was one combo, guys. Do you see it? I mean, I'm pretty sure that whenever I'm fighting players that are same CP with me I can take them away like I do a, I'll do way more damage than they do because how my branch damage is built but when I'm whenever you're fighting higher CP players I mean it's just how the game is designed like you won't be able to do too much damage so you will ha really have to manage your um, your C uh, your do uh, your dodges your dashes correctly in the uh, arena or else you will run out of dash and die really quick all right guys we will be jump into the last match of the day and i think this will be another reaper and let's see how we can do against other reapers okay oh wow he's doing a lot of damage Yeah, guys, he, she's definitely doing a lot of damage and more damage than us. All 
all right that wasn't as good as i expected it was gonna go and yeah guys when you're at this uh level in rank arena everyone you face is pretty much going to be higher cp than you and my cp ranking is only 300 something global and but my arena ranking is already around 100 so it, it will be really hard for me to keep pushing further at this point but yeah anyway so here are my branch damages that if you guys want to know what reaper um uh, what Reaper skill requires what kind of branch damage and they're right here and so if you can max out your three of them you can just go for a brief and a heap is the same thing because these two skills can also be applied with a brief or a heap Alright guys, that will be it for today's video. Please leave a like and comment down below to let me know what you guys think. And please subscribe to my channel, hit that bell button. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.